there's been a lot of focus on the mental health of teenagers after a year of sporadic in person learning and lost social opportunities. So could a social networking app help kids get back to some meaningful connections and relationships? Denver 7 education reporter Nicole Brady joins us taking a look at the new tool here. Yeah, Molly studies show Generation Z people in their late teens and early 20s right now are the loneliest generation. They have had 50% fewer interactions than someone who was in high school in the year 2000. The developer of this app says we need to meet kids where they're at on their smartphones. These aren't going away. So Grit Digital Health in Denver has already introduced the app Nod to college campuses. It has a few main features. First, testimonials, real stories from teens who had challenges with loneliness. Second, steps for getting out into the real world and practicing interactions and building relationships. And third, reflections to help students reflect on those interactions and decide where they want to take their connections. Nod is like a workout app for one social life. And what's really different about it is unlike a lot of social media apps, which encourage you to stay in the app and use it and friend and like things, this is all about getting out into the real world, whether that's virtually or, or in person in light of public health guidelines, but to practice those skills. And so now the next step is taking this to high schoolers. The Colorado Education Initiative is just finishing up interviews with teenagers so that they can tailor this app to that age group. And Marcus Bratton with Colorado Education Initiative says high schoolers have seemed really interested. And, and this is something that I think students are naming as a need for themselves. And so when we think about uh, building this out, offering it to more high schools, um, I think really the, the peer to peer endorsement is going to be a big part of that. Nod will launch as a pilot program with North High School and 5280 High School in Denver for the next school year with the goal, as he said, of expanding to all high schoolers and possibly even into other age groups eventually. Molly.